All right, welcome to 118. Uh, today's video, we're going to look at the Fortnite solo mode Fenix skin. The Fenix is a rare outfit in Fortnite Battle Royale that can be purchased from the item shop for 1200 V Bucks. Fenix was first released in Season X and is part of the Fur Force set. And here he is with his Spike clone, and this is all that came in the pack. It did not come uh, with his Fox pack, which would be his back bling. That might be in a blind bag or some other. Uh, Fortnite item or Fortnite package and he did not come with the stand either. All right. Well, let's uh, have a look at him All right. Well, here's Fenix in his default pose We can kind of look at some of the detail here. That looks pretty good. All right and taking a look at some of the features here It's got a nice head sculpt and the print it, the paint on here is pretty decent for uh, the size of figure it is uh, Pretty nice paint detailing on the the shoulder armor there uh, even with the sculpt of the fur there um, and yeah, going down here, the paint on the belt and the detail of sculpting on the belt with the zipper. So that's actually pretty well done. And kind of this uh, this little tattooed little mark here of whatever that is, probably the symbol used in the game. And even though there's a little bit of paint bleed here, that actually does look pretty nice how they put the yellow within that. So I'm I, overall, I'd say they do, did a good job with the detail of the paint and the sculpt work. Um, even looking at the tail here, you have the white at the end, and it kind of has a little gradient uh, to the orange. Yeah, and even the back here with uh, the stripes here. And yeah, even this, this is a different color as well. Um, maybe the same yellow used here. And then, yeah, it did a good job of doing that all around. So, um, yeah, even the gradient down at the feet. You know, all in all, this is just a really detailed figure, you know, for the price. And to get a look at some articulation uh, with the head, uh, that looks like it's kind of an issue. I think it has to do with this collar here. So he can look around and really turn all the way. The up is not too high, uh, but that can, eh, that's good enough. Down, goes down quite a bit. So actually, depending on how you have him positioned, you might be able to get away with quite a bit, actually, yeah. So that, d that does pretty good considering this uh, collar back here. So kudos for that. Um, so down at the arms, let's see. Now it's got those uh, shoulder pads, but that doesn't you know stop it from going up pretty good. That's almost a 90. Yeah, pretty much a 90 there. So that's not bad. And then the waist uh, or the abdomen here, it's got a crunch. Um, that's actually fairly decent. Not too much, but pretty good there. Um, and then it's got a swivel, and this swivel is, is kind of tight. And now I don't know if that's done on purpose because it's part of the construction of these Fortnite figures they kind of have a unique construction to them um and the tail on the back um it's a little loose it's probably just mine like right here and it's not too noticeable really i mean it kind of falls if you yeah you get it in the right position but but all in all that actually works out pretty good um and then yeah before i forget actually so with the elbow here, uh, they have it where the joint for the swivel is at the elbow, so that's not bad at all. Um, the hand itself uh, also, uh, not only does it have its own little swivel, but it has a hinge too, so a lot of options there. I would, it has the horizontal. I would like the vertical as well. That would go good for a lot of the weapons. Uh, I almost wish they did one hand vertical, one hand horizontal. And then down here at the the feet, we could see where the, the legs can move out. Now, the little grenade thing or whatever here is kind of blocking it, but you can still get it out quite a bit. Um, and we have the uh, swivel at the thigh. Knee goes back quite a bit. Um, yeah, and there's a lot of articulation here with the foot, and I think a lot of that has to do with... Um, the shape, it's not a typical human foot because this is a fox. It's humanoid. But, uh, yeah, you get a lot of, yeah, you can get a lot of uh, articulation out of that. And you really just notice as it came down here, the white detail on here, it's, you know, asymmetrical to the rest of it. So, all right, all in all, this is a good figure, you know, $10 from this Fort. Night solo line. Uh, it's kind of widely available right now in many places, uh, but sure worth picking up. Thanks for watching.